Before diving into code, we need to install tools to develop our e-commerce shopping cart. We need four tools. The first one is VS Code, which you can download from this link and follow the instruction to install VS Code. Also, we need Git, which is a version control system. The third tool is Node.js, uh, which you can download from this URL and install it in your computer. And the last one is Yarn, which is a Node.js package manager, which you will need it to work with React. After installing these four tools, we need to config VS Code. First of all, we need to install ES7 React Redux snippet. Click on extension menu and here search for ES7 React Redux snippet. Click on it and click on install because I have already installed ES7 React. You see uninstalled, but for your VS Code, you will see install button. You will click on it and it will install in a second. For Windows users, you need to config the terminal because you want to change the terminal executor from PowerShell to Bash because after you install the git, you will have bash.exe at this address and you need to follow this path from file menu preference setting features and inside the features select terminal and edit on json.setting add this code to the setting.json to let the integrated terminal run bash.exe instead of powershell.exe. Then press start the VS Code. Now your VS Code is ready to create React app.